In other news, surprising new details in an elevator mystery that many people thought would never be solved. Craig Bigelow reports as NLM News continues to bring you answers. A lost elevator? In America? Impossible, you say, but not according to this building's historical records. It all happened in 1931 in this, the Robinson Building. A businessman waiting to leave his accounting office on the 57th floor. A grandmother waiting to take her poodle to the grooming salon on the 42nd. And a courier boy waiting to deliver a crate of frozen fish to a Japanese sushi cafe up on the 30th. All waited in astonishment as the usually punctual express elevator number three never appeared to take them to their desired floors. It was their complaints which caused the building clerk to take note of the suspicious elevator activity and report it to the building inspector general. After preliminary investigations, no conclusive explanation was ever presented to the public, immediately triggering a myriad of conspiracy theories as to what happened to the elevator and why it would suddenly become lost for such an extended period of time. Despite the differing theories, no one ever discovered just what exactly took place in that elevator during its time off the grid. Until now. Over 80 years later, thanks to our investigative research, our team uncovered a story so shocking that, well, you'll have to hear it to believe it. Craig Bigelow, NLM News, New York. Coming soon, The Lost Elevator from Northern Lights Radio Theater.